was the night before Christmas when all through hay day every tablet and phone was in use just to play. The machines were already trucks and boats standing still, in the hopes that St. Nicholas soon be there to fill. The players were nestled all snug on their farms, with visions of diamonds falling into their arms, and Mamma buying bems and I adding a pup had settled down after levelling up. When out in the fields there arose such a clatter, I popped back from fishing to see what was the matter. Away to my barn I flew like a flash, opened and closed it and let out a gasp. The moon on the breast of the new-fallen snow gave the trees on my farm a sparkly new glow. When what to my wondering eyes should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight hay-day reindeer? With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles his courses they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Alfred, now Greg, now Mike and Tilly, on Joan, on Angus, on Tom and Mary. To the top of the barn, Silo and Derry he called. Now dash away, dash away, dash away all. The cows were a-mooing, the chickens did cluck, pigs oinking, sheeps barring, the dogs ran amuck. They circled the farm, the courses they flew, with a sleigh full of products and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling I heard the snow poof, with the prancing and pouring of each little hoof. And as I looked at my derby just counting coin cash, down the racetrack St. Nicholas came like a flash. He was dressed all in fur, from his head to his toes, and his clothes were all covered with wheat corn and tomatoes. A bundle of game gifts he had flung on his back, he looked like a peddler just opening in his pack. His eyes how they twinkled, his dimples how merry, his cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bowl, and the beard of his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a round little belly, that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to work, and filled the boats, trucks and machines, then turned with a jerk, and laying his finger aside of his nose, and giving a nod free diamonds did explode. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew like a down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim ere he drove out of sight, Happy heyday Christmas to all, and to all a heyday good night.